Hey everyone, Chris here with the Colorado Avalanche Information Center. Bill and I are traveling here, southern part of the North San Juan zone, just north of kind of our imaginary north and south San Juan boundary here on Bear Mountain, looking at southeast facing slopes. We had a couple uh, wet slabs pop in the La Plata's, so further south in the South San Juan, one was skier triggered, one was natural, um, occurring on east and southeast aspects. So we came up here today to see is that similar structure, is that similar likelihood, are we finding it here um, in the Bear Sultan zone? So we're gonna do an extended column test and see what it tells us. So we got full propagation in our weak layer below our slab on 14 taps. Recent warm weather over the past two to three days has moistened and stiffened our upper slab. It's also introduced liquid water into some moist facets sitting under this slab. That water creates a weaker bond in these grains, allowing this slab to collapse and fail across a slope. As a rider steps on to steeper terrain, 35 degrees or greater, their added force and weight also makes that slab more likely to fail. And so the threat and likelihood of triggering one of these is still elevated until we see cooler temperatures in the next coming days.